Anyway, Zack has gone on for a little while, and there have been some good and bad episodes of this show. Mostly bad when the show decides to use its brain to go up with something called a plot. So today I'm going to recount my top 5 worst Henry and Zack episodes and why they are bad. I've already done this before in worst to best format, but I want to redo that because that video has some flaws. Anyway, on with the show! Number 5. Henry on the Moon the main problem with this episode is its unnecessary bad treatment towards Zack. And when I say unnecessary, I really mean that because this episode's plot is literally non-existent. To prove this, I'll recite the episode's plot. Henry goes to the moon again. An explosion happens on Earth, resulting in Zack being blown up to the moon and breaking his leg. What kind of plot is that? It's like I didn't know what should happen after Henry saying he's on the moon, so I just resorted to hurting Zack as if he's Squidward from Spongebob Season 6. In conclusion, I don't really like this episode, 4 out of 10. Number 4. How they met. If you were paying attention to the thumbnail, you would have seen I put the words DON'T WATCH at the top of the picture. That was a recent change because at that time I thought it was the absolute worst Henry and Zack episode. But since this is number 4, you could see I changed my mind on that one. But what in the world made me think this was so bad? Basically, the exact same reason as the last one. Bad treatment towards Zack and lack of plot. I'll run down the plot of the episode. It is very similar to the last one, but even worse. Henry is sitting in the yard and that he has no friends. Zack appears and breaks his leg again, and then Henry uses the telekinesis he has and is totally not Zack's power at all to throw Zack's disembodied leg at his skull. The end. That makes even less sense than the last episode on this list. And it also doesn't make any sense in the lore of the series since there was a short film made back in season 4 called The Beginning that recites how Henry and Zack became friends. And the story in that is completely different. So which one is the true story? Well if you watch the season 14 episode Zack's Beginning, you can see that he's wearing the same outfit as he is in this episode. So that means that this episode is what actually happens, unfortunately. Overall, this episode is even dumber than the last, but it's not so bad that its score gets knocked down a point. 4 out of 10 again. Number 3. Risen and Left So instead of this episode going out of its way to hurt Zack for no reason, this episode goes out of its way to do absolutely nothing. The plot of the episode is Metal Henry is annoyed that the evil cyborg keeps forgetting about him, so he teams up with Henry and Zack to bully him. That sounds like a really entertaining episode, and it barely lasted a minute. I have no problem with short episodes and shows. Most of the time they're quick, straight to the point, and don't waste your time. But this episode is too fast for me to care about Basil Henry's struggles. And the problem is resolved in 30 seconds, and it's not even portrayed as a joke. Overall, the plot is good, but absolutely nothing is done with it, and is resolved in 30 seconds. 3 out of 10. But hey, at least Zack's not getting hurt anymore. Glad we moved past that phase. Number 2. The Sky. It's spoke too soon. I cannot help but notice that this is yet another episode that depicts Zack's unjustified suffering, which seems to be a recurring theme in this show. I find it unacceptable that Henry, who's supposed to be Zack's best friend, is deliberately and shamelessly causing him harm by crushing him with a fridge. This behavior is not only rude, but also upsetting. And I fail to understand how I ever thought this was funny. One out of 10. Out of all the episodes I've mentioned on this list, what could be worse? All of these episodes have been horrifically unpleasant to watch or boring, but so far none of these have been as offensive as this one. So without further ado, I present to you the absolute worst episode of Henry and Zack of all time. A sports day. Imagine you've had a long, great friendship with someone, you see them almost every day at school, and you're nice to each other, and one day you come home from school and it turns out they made an animation for the whole world to see about you being a conceited and rude friend, after all you've done for them. That's just this episode. If you haven't seen it, first of all, thank God, and secondly, it's about Henry and Zack getting invited to a sports day event thing, and they're at odds with each other. 
And that plot is good. SpongeBob has done that before, and it's one of its best episodes. But when Henry and Zack do the race, well, just watch for yourself. Haha, <laughs> I'm winning! No, you're not. I'm in front of you! You're losing, you're so bad at this! You have to train for this! Ha! <laughs> Tell me, does that sound like something the Zack from Henry and Zack you know would say? The answer is no, because he would never say that. You know the episode of Spongebob I mentioned earlier? What would you think of it if Spongebob was an arrogant turd throughout the episode and gets his legs ripped off and gets trampled by everyone at the end? You wouldn't like it, would you? That scene of Zack I showed you is so bad that if you watch it now, you can see that the scene is no longer present. That's because I removed it and apologized to Zack. And by the way, me and Zack are friends in real life, which makes this a thousand times worse. I wouldn't give this episode even a rating above 1, I'd give it a 0 out of 10. By the way, me talking about all these episodes that involve Zack being hurt or misbetrayed is a form of my apology. I really want to delete these episodes, but I've decided to keep them up to embrace my mistakes. Other than that scene in Sports Day, and Zack, if you're watching this, I'm really sorry for all these things I've created. Even though you've already accepted my apology, I'm still really sorry about these. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed this list. You may disagree with my opinion, and that's alright. I'd like to know what your favourite and least favourite Henry and Zack episode is. You can tell me in the comments. Anyhow, goodbye!